about my money though It's funny bro, let's see if it's funny when me and Mac Snatch your hoe, cash get close Drop a banger, pick a foe She wants some more, I told her no and put her out the door Cause the flow, colder than the wind What's good? What's good, Mama? Shut yeah, up, why are you Rasta? eating? What's good, Mo Mafia? It's your girl Mo, and as y'all can tell by the title, I'm back with another move back. And y'all, before we get into this video, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, hit that bell so y'all know when I'm dropping move bangers, and make sure y'all check out the entire game. I got the baby mama here. She got on the Zabuma Fouché. I don't know who the fuck these belong to, but thank y'all. Y'all, she didn't did the scratch corny as shit. I had to drag her into this video, y'all. I, I am so fucking excited. We made the homemade Caesar salad chicken, chicken no, sandwiches. Chicken Caesar salad sandwich. Chicken Caesar salad sandwiches on some hoagie rolls. We took the bread out, mm -hmm. garlic, garlic, homemade, homemade garlic, garlic butter, butter with. With the Baby mama did that. garlic clove in the oven and push mm -hmm. it out she like the fancy motherfucker. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, we did that, but we gonna say this prayer because a bitch is salivating and she's eating already. Oh. God is good, God is great, and we thank Him for this food. We gonna thank Him in the morning, noon, and night because God, God, God is dynamite. I'm in. I'm in. Gang, come on, we gonna taste it at the same time. The Lord time. be having me turned up. Y'all, I'm about to take I a good I feel like I'm bite. too short. Why well, I, I feel like it ain't enough meat in my bread. You want another patty? No. Cause that's gonna be too much. What are you doing? I can't, I can't reach it, I You act like. just like your son. Scoop the plate closer. Okay. Oh God, it's so good. Mmm. Mmm, so good. Mmm. It tastes like lemon pepper. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mmm. My salad falling out. It's so crunchy and messy. I love me a good crunchy, messy salad. Mmm. That garlic butter. different flavors coming yeah, it's everywhere. everything you want in a sandwich the bread holds one flavor the chicken holds another flavor and then you got a salad mm. with the caesar mm. Y'all, this is good. Mm. Mm. <laughs> we got Lay's chips and the new Miss Vicky's sour cream and herb. herb and onion. Y'all, so many crumbs in my titties. <laughs> <laughs> From this bread. Y'all, let me tell y'all how we made it. Just some chicken bread. Beat them down really thin. You know, you split them in half or did you? Yeah, it was two, this was two chicken breads. Yeah, I know. What? Yes. They so were you big. you split them in over half. Four. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, split the chicken breast into fours. Beat it down. Season it up with a whole bunch of, like, seasoning. No thought. Seasoning. Right, because, you know... <laughs> A bitch blood Mrs. Dash high. is like the new fan favorite in this household. I think we got every flavor of Mrs. Dash. Mm-hmm. No. Well. This came together really well. Mm. Yeah, I can't. 
that crunches everything. But it's soft in the middle. Mm hmm. I told you. You need to remake our bread. I said the bread burnt. It's hard. The bread is not burnt. Where? Mm -hmm. It's not burnt. Not where? It's in Yum. the crispy. Season it up. Look, you can go on TikTok and find it. Mm -hmm. You literally can. But Caesar salad mix. Panko bread comes mixed with what's that called? Parmesan. Parmesan. Cheese. Grated Parmesan. Grated Parmesan, 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 Parmesan cheese. cheese. I can't get into my how I want to. Y'all know I'm a messy eater. You know, I gotta be able to get into it. It's too big. Mm -hmm. We gotta bust her down the middle. Mm. Oh, it's so crunchy. Oh, come on. Mm -hmm. Yes. We gotta make it accessible. Oh. Mm. She's mm -hmm. so sexy now. I'm <laughs> Look at her. Yeah. And we got another PM. Mama has mayo on her bread. I don't. I had to, y'all. Y'all know I can't eat no sandwich without no mayo. Ooh. But mine's is fire without it. <laughs> mm. Yeah. Mm. Ooh, no. Just try it with the lace. I know you didn't want them chips, but mm. it's so good. Mm -hmm. It's good. It's good. Yeah. Go your ass on TikTok, type in chicken Caesar salad sandwich and make this. Took some Kerrygold butter, oven roasted garlic with a little oil. Mix that together. Because Kerrygold is the best butter. With a little bit of Parmesan, grated Parmesan. Brush that on the bread, put it in the oven. Took the chicken, seasoned it, dipped it in regular flour, egg, then breadcrumbs mixed with Parmesan, grated Parmesan, breading. Fried it up. And then we put it in the oven with melted, what is that, provolone and mozzarella cheese over the top. <laughs> mm. This really came together. It must be good because Mimi don't be eating this much. She is tearing that shit up. And I'm not high. Empty ain't high. Mmm. Mm. On my soul, <laughs> they missed out. This is my, he is on my, hmm? he is on my, look at all that fucking chicken behind you. Mm hmm. Hell is cooking left. And our kids. They just had Subway. Mm-hmm. We didn't eat nothing. And now they want All day. And now they want what we got, too, even though they just had Subway. Because when you hear it, it don't sound like what they wanted. So they're like, yeah, we'll take Subway instead. Order them Subway. Once it get cooked, we want some of that, too. <laughs> Greedy. Greedy the fuck do if you haven't tried the uh, Miss Vicky sour cream and herb and onion, you can get it right here. Mm hmm. Miss Vicky always not done. I was going to say, when do they miss though? All the Miss Vicky's is good. Literally, all of them. Miss Vicky don't come to play, y'all. It's a crumb party in between my tits. <laughs> I'm telling you right goddamn now. Look at that. Mm. Oh, mama. Mm. You need to top it? Mm-hmm. You want to see a comment? Don't need some more chip. You want to see a comment somebody left on my TikTok? 
Ở cái tình thần sát đó Được chưa? Ở trong Ở trong này hết mình được thích sát Ở trong này Yeah I think I did earlier Mmm Mm-mm-mm-mm. <laughs> I don't want to talk about that. <laughs> the famous. Why not? No, but the mind boggling part, forget all of that. It was the end. You and your kids. How the fuck were the kids? I don't want to talk about nothing negative. Let's talk about PD and me. Let's talk about who? P. Diddy. You think he did it? No, you think you the parties it? was the parties? Hell yeah, I think that. Have you seen the paperwork? Mm -mm. Go on Facebook. They got the paperwork. So I deleted my Facebook app so I can't show you, but you got to go on Facebook. They got the paperwork. Now, one thing I would say is I firmly do believe that P. Diddy is just a grown-ass man that likes to party. There is no proof of nothing pertaining to no minors. They saying that's what took place, but they don't have proof of that. The things that they have proof of, let's say Cassie, all of that, all these motherfuckers grown. Right. And whatever took place when they wasn't grown, unfortunately, we can't really, we don't know, you ain't tell us then. You know what I'm saying? You wait until now that you grown to say something, so we look at you like you a grown ass woman, and you just trying to get some money. That's how we look at it now. Him having parties with crack, Dope, sex workers, all of that. Them people did that because they wanted to. Right. Everybody like to party different. It ain't my cup of tea. Right. But I genuinely believe that Diddy is the fall guy, if you ask me. I feel like it's deeper than P. Diddy. And I think that they are using him as the fall guy. I don't mm -hmm. think they raided Diddy house to find evidence. I think they raided his house to hide evidence. If you ask me. But. Damn. I never thought about it like that. Who am I? You know what I'm saying? Because it's deeper than what the fuck they showing you on the shade room or Facebook or mm -hmm. the public records. It's deeper than that. And there's no way this man been doing this for many, many years with many, many people. And they not down with that. So I feel like just as much as y'all can blame P. Diddy, y'all got to blame everybody else because they was all incident parties too. Reality Man, did you is, see Stevie J post a little promo video? Yes, he ain't making it no better. Reality is, people like to party, and I'm about to be 30 years old. And if you ask me, I've been to some wild parties. If I can get 20 bitches butt ass naked going buck wild in the room right now, I'll probably do it. Tell them to bring me my money. Yeah! And I don't want y'all to be saying I'm a sex worker or they sex working for me. It's just people like the party. You only live one life, man. Not and a minor shit. Minor, mm -mm. unacceptable. But where's the proof? That's what I want to know. The proof that they have, they're all adults. They're talking about other celebrities that go to these parties and stuff. That's the proof that they have. And all these celebrities are grown. Right. Whatever they do in their private life and personal time. Y'all don't fucking know. I like to be choked till I pass out and die and then bring me back unconscious. Y'all didn't know that. What? That's my business. You know? So I just feel like whatever people do in their personal life is them. If it's not no molestation, no rape, no right. minor, no nothing like that. They all grown as fuck. I feel like... It's it's like trending to expose people. You yeah, know, man. I feel like right now everybody wants to expose somebody and it's it's becoming like a thing. I'll just expose you. Shut your stupid You know how many videos and pictures I got on my Snapchat from years ago? Butt ass naked. Hey, do what you gotta do, Charlie. Oh, you had that granny dress Make on that, that side house? That was recent. I mean, not recent, but you know. Like eight months ago. Yeah, I should get this money. You exposed me. I got shit on YouTube. You exposed me. Might give me some money. You exposed me. What a pot! Okay. Um. Water park is crazy. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah.
at the end of the day, they got to keep us tuned into something. You mm -hmm. feel me? So it's like every couple months, something coming out. You know what I'm saying? It's like, it's like they trying to like condition us into just, well, some some gonna hit the fan. I feel like Diddy own people ratted him out because once again, I feel like it was too high evidence rather than fine evidence. So I feel like they know that more would have came out if they would have searched elsewhere rather than Diddy home. Yeah, I'm gonna tell y'all, when it come to famous people, they be dumb as fuck. You gotta be smarter than that to be recording shit like this. And I know that some people, they into shit like that. But when you are who you are and you doing all that, reality is you keep living that moment over. What are you recording it for? Like it's never going to happen again. Exactly. That's how I look at it. That's where people fuck they self up at. Because when you record something, the narrative can be made any which way they want it to be made. Right. Because they got it on camera. Mm -hmm. So you can't even, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all know us humans, we can deny a lot of shit. Us normal people because we're your proof. Right. Them, if you got that shit on recording, on video, and you keeping it in your home, like... And you already a celebrity with it? Right. And you got videos of a table full of cocaine and bitches butt-ass naked, drunk and high and sucking dick and all that. Of course they gonna think you took advantage. Because you ain't got the part on camera when they, they was willing to do this and shit. And they, they knew that they... I, listen, if I ever get rich to the point where I get to having all them weird, wild ass parties, which I probably wouldn't even do that. I I'm, would. I'm, Go on, shake that ass, bitch. I'm gonna throw this guy out. Shut <laughs> <laughs> your ass up. Baby, you can suck dick. You on barely my want strippers at birthday parties. Talking about some, you gonna throw these type of things. Only when I was Shut in a relationship, up. single. Baby, suck dick on my living room table. I want to see. <laughs> Spread her open, boogie butt. Shut up, baby. You know? She is a clown. You about to eat her booty? <laughs> Let me see. Shut you, up, bro. I'm just being honest. Listen, y'all. At the yeah. end of the day, if I, I would never do that, but like, let's say I decided to, right? I'm not going to record for long. No. Maybe not. But that was my point. My point is, I'm not. bitch going to have to sign a waiver. Or some type of agreement. Show proof of ID. We going to scan that bitch and have it in the file. Waiting on a motherfucker to come at me with some weirdo shit. Y'all got to get smarter as celebrities. But back then, y'all were, it was like back in the day, right? Mm-mm. Supposedly. So who was that other celebrity that came out and supposedly they was having parties and stuff like that? When they was confiscating people's phones at the front door, making them sign waivers and all that. You see they shit came out and it disappeared ASAP. Because a motherfucker ain't had that on You can't do shit once you sign a waiver. Once you sign that NDA, you can't disclose shit, bitch. Over with. I'm what happens here stays here. Me too, I've been for. I'm, mm. That's like my 30th birthday, y'all. FYI, I'm having an all-girls trip in Virgin Island. Y'all bitches are signing NDAs. You swear to God! Say you swear to God! It's gonna be um, that lit. Y'all <laughs> <laughs> gonna tell my business. Y'all ain't about to tell my business. Cause I might be butt naked on that bitch getting pounded somewhere. You know, he gonna say my hoop, but... Mind your business. Yeah, y'all got to sign an NDA. Yeah, you know what I mean, you I feel know. like grown people should be able to have fun, too. Yeah, but again, we want to just reiterate the minor shit, all them yes. accusations. We ain't with that shit. Now, again, we just want y'all to know this is based off of so far the, the things we've seen. We might not have seen everything. You know what I'm saying? So don't think what we saying is saying we support P. Diddy or anything like that. If it's strictly so far based off of what we right. have seen, this is our opinion. Because honestly, I haven't really like... I don't think I've seen enough, mm -hmm. if you ask me. I haven't dug too deep. Y'all know I'm not real big on like celebrity news and shit like that. But Mimi, she be knowing it. I normally do, but I haven't been into it. I haven't took my time Girl, out I just want one more bite. Girl, I got weed in my coochie. Huh? What the hell? 
Excuse me, y'all. Mm. But yeah, um, so yeah, anything pertaining to a minor, unacceptable. I am a mother and I'll blow a bitch cap back blue. Okay? So we're not talking about that. I'm talking about strictly on the adults party and having fun. That's all I'm talking about. That's it. That's all. Mm. So don't try to make this into something that it's not. Now, if they just adults having fun and they all mutually agree and this this the party they having, I don't think they wrong. Now, if you got sex workers and you making them do shit against their will or minors and stuff like that, you deserve to rot the fucking hell. But Damn another thing them. that made it suspicious to me, everybody in the whole world know young Miami name is Carisha. Everybody know this. If y'all look at the paperwork that supposedly dropped, they created a whole nother name for Young Miami. And then they put an exclamation mark in quotation what's named Young Miami. That's not her. So it made me feel like some shit is falsified or something. Because nobody in this world that. don't know her name is Carisha. Everybody know this. Go look it up. I'm telling you. Go look it up. And that kind of paused me right there when they were talking about sex workers and all of that. Supposedly, she bought him pink cocaine to an event or something like that. The fuck is pink? I don't know nothing about cocaine. I thought it was only white. But I guess they got some good pink shit. And Carisha took part in it and she bought it for him and took it to wherever he was at or whatever. But my whole thing is, how y'all try to add her in there for taking her nigga or her little boot thing, her little yeah, yeah, some cocaine. If she know he do cocaine, if that's what he do, why is that illegal though, cocaine? Why wouldn't she supply his habit? But ain't cocaine illegal? It depends on where they at. And suppose no, we, cocaine is illegal everywhere. It's not. Like, yes, it is. No, it's not. I don't know. What? Don't give me the line. And supposedly Yo, he, he had houses. Cocaine illegal everywhere. Supposedly he had a house in Virgin Islands, girl, with sex workers. They said Virgin Islands, Cali. It was all kind of places. He had different states. And I just feel like crazy. if P Diddy been running this big organization and all of y'all know about it, y'all should be more wrong to him. Right, so nobody spoke up because ever? it wasn't. Until you mean to tell me every single celebrity that ever been to his parties? Is a sicko. Exactly. It wasn't until well, I don't know. It wasn't until Cassie supposedly came out. Now all of a sudden, a whole bunch of people coming out and stuff like that. And I hate the narrative that people paint that sometimes it takes other people to come out for you to go bullshit. Oh. I'm telling off the bat, off the rip. You lying. You're lying. And I don't know. I've never been the type of bitch. Ain't enough money in this world to silence me. You're I'm going lying. to jail. <laughs> what are you talking about? So why did it take to 2023 for Cassie right. to come out? And then supposedly they saying this some shit when she was 16. The bitch is 40. <laughs> I look at little shit you like know, that. It's me. Cassie, bro. Now. Yes, I'm bro. Leaning. Think I, wanna make I look at little shit little like that. Like, now. it's so weird Her? to me. Yes, Cassie, bro. Damn. That's over 20 years. If it take you Please over 20 to years to come out, then the I mirror. just feel like... At the Y. You're lying. I'm sorry. And I understand it take people time and everything like that. Because I myself has been a victim of things like that. So I already know. But 20 years, you're lying. You're seeking money. And then not to mention. It's let's getting take it broke back. now. Let's take it back. to No, when you first, never know though. No, bro. because when it first came out, Cassie settled for a settlement. She agreed to a settlement until her team told her basically that wasn't a fuck enough. Let's be real. Let's take it all the way back. Y'all can't just speak on one thing. Y'all got to speak on everything. She agreed to a settlement before. And her, so, so she was going to take money. That's to, all she wanted money. was money. That's and her crazy. team convinced her that that wasn't enough. So now she want to make it seem like it's about justice. Now I heard about that. You accepted a settlement, bro. Like, bitches just be I heard money. about I'm it, but sorry. I didn't know how true it was. Like, I just heard about it, like, on the, you know how you scrolling and people mm -hmm. be, like, covering shit? I'm like, what are they talking about? Mm -hmm. But damn. Yeah. That's crazy. I mean, y'all, comment down below. Let us know what y'all think. How y'all feel about the Diddy situation. If y'all think he guilty. If y'all think everything is true. If y'all think some of it may be true and some may not. Just, you know what I'm saying? Chime in with us. Let us know what y'all think. This shit was good as hell, y'all. He definitely he, guilty. He a perverted ass motherfucker. Whoever what? came up with this. I think they willing. You did your big one. See, chicken Caesar salad mm. sandwich, y'all. Mimi got a big ass piece left. I told my shit down. The chicken was so crunchy and good. And juicy. It was so good. It was perfect. Mm-hmm. Take a bite. Okay. Damn, y'all. We didn't even give y'all a bite, huh? It's cold now. We sorry. Mm. Damn. It's so good, though. 
It is, y'all. Well, my mafia, I'm going to go ahead and get out y'all away. Make sure y'all comment down below. Let us know what y'all think about the situation. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Hit that bell so y'all know when we drop in move. Bye! No, I, I said we. We, we ain't dropping shit. This all you get, Mookie Bud. Oh, I'm saying we might do another, another mukbang nah. sometime down the line. Mm. Like a year or so. Oh, well, okay. I only get one a year out your ass. <laughs> oh, okay, I'm more like it. Yeah, She's so girl. irritating, y'all. <laughs> all right, my mom. We ain't dropping shit. We finna again. Oh, wait. Before Make sure y'all follow me on my new TikTok, Rasta Swisher. I'll put it right here. Y'all go follow me, me new TikTok. Cause they took my first one at three hundred some k, and they took my auntie candy one at four hundred some k, and they be really hating on me and pressed on me, but I'm a bounce. But I told her time. she gotta learn how to chill out on TikTok, cause she be doing too much. Cause who the fuck you talking to, old pussy ass, ball head ass, big back ass, vinegar bottle body built ass bitch? Okay, Teron Junior. But that's why vinegar I be body built ass. Bitch. That bottle in the cabinet. That big one. <laughs> but that's why I be getting kicked off TikTok. Yeah, she. she I'm gonna do better most. this time. I promise. But yeah, y'all, I'm gonna go ahead and get out y'all way, man. My mafia. Uh, what I was gonna say is Ooh, put some salad on a chip that make it like small back instead of big back. Mm hmm. Fat. Anyway, what I was gonna say was, uh -huh. damn, you made me forget. Oh, Mimi will be dropping the part two of our first Q&A from Christmas. Um, right after next, this drop. Yeah, like in the next couple days or maybe before this. I don't know because I got two videos. I got a second half of our Q&A and this video to edit. Plus, I'm going to drop it after this one. Okay, cool. I'm going to drop it after All right, y'all. So be looking out for that video. And Mo Mafia, we finna get lit because we the shit gang. That shit was good. It's really good, actually. And you know, normally Damn I, ain't gonna, good. I ain't gonna eat that, but I'm eating this baby. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> no, I'm talking about for later. Little mama gotta get saved. And look at all that chicken left. It's hella chicken. Because I thought we was gonna need, like, on the other people's videos, I saw more than one. Mm -hmm. We They be. We only needed one per what's name. Yeah. But your kids said they want, Mom, why we always got extra behind um. the scene? <laughs> Fucking play with me. Don't ever in your motherfucking life pluck your motherfucking nose. You sound great. That wasn't even for you. That was for your supporters. Quit. Bye, y'all.